What is up YouTube? Happy Monday. Mine and Tankster's deload week is officially over, so we are ready to hit it full force and go for them PRs. You go, I go, you stay, I stay, one song to sing. Quick announcement, I want to show you guys something. As you can see, I am wearing, I'm rocking the new Team Online Coach Snapback in the camo color. It's pretty fresh. Those are now in the store available. They're selling pretty fast, so I suggest jumping on there and just uh, checking them out. And then also something new that we got is the Team Online Coach Cotton Sweats, Cotton Shorts, I'm sorry. Um, Tankster's wearing a pair today. Have you washed and dried those? Yep. Yep, and he's wearing the small, and this is how the logo looks. Established 2012, Motivate, Inspire, Educate. As you guys know, that's my, um, that's my mantra. That's, that's what I, I live by, and that's what I preach to everyone you know, around Team The Online Coach. What's up, guys? So here's some footage of our upper power workout. Apologize for not uploading any videos um, the past two three days have been uh, swamped with uh, clients new clients and uh, got a couple couple of uh, contest prep clients getting ready for a show so I wanted to give uh, all my clients just the, uh, the attention and the detail that they deserve so I've kind of been taking a break from posting the videos editing the videos but uh I should be putting them up regular once a day um, back to normal. So we start off with bench press. Um, here is my first working set of 315. I got it for four times, four reps. Again, I'll shoot for five, but you know, I just didn't have, have it in me this week yet. But uh, I will get there. Bar speed was definitely a little bit quicker than last week, so I'm happy with that. And yeah, it felt felt lighter. The 315 actually felt a little bit lighter than last week, so um, that's that's little 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 progress in my in my book. All right, moved on to incline bench press. So bench press, we did three sets of three to five reps. And incline bench, we did three sets, six to eight reps. We got tankster with, uh, how much is that, 135, 40, 45, 150. He hit that for some for a good amount of reps. I believe that was a PR for him. He is definitely progressing in all his lifts. And I'm really happy for him. You gotta look at it, uh, you know, your, your strength is your best indicator as a natural bodybuilder of um, how much muscle you're you're gaining, I think it's the the most clear, the most the best indicator. So if your strength is going up in in all your lifts, then you're most likely adding more muscle. You're growing. You're making gains. So let that be your indicator, guys. All right, Penlay Rose. Um, on this day, I felt pretty damn good. Um, I think my form was just on point. I was just firing my, my lats, my back, um, just perfectly, driving with my elbows, keeping the, uh, the momentum, the jerking um, minimal. So I decided to bump up the weight to 225, as you can see here. We did four sets of six to eight reps on this penlay row, and I believe... I got 225 for 8 reps for the first, and then 9 for the remaining 3. My right, weighted pull-ups was next. 3 sets, 6 to 8 reps. And this is just, this is clockwork to us, guys. This is a routine pull-ups, weighted pull-ups. We've been both progressing in weight and uh, both very happy with it. 
and guys, tra- training is not all about mixing things up, shocking the muscles. Um, that is not required to make gains or to progress. It's actually, in, in, in my opinion, it's not. It's not as efficient as sticking to a, a good all-around complete split a pro- workout program and just sticking to the basics with accessory work. Um, and just sticking to those movements and progressing in the weight. It takes time. You're not going to you know, produce strength and gains in those lifts just week after week. you got to take, take the time to put in the work, um, maximize your form, and just be patient. So for those who believe that, that BS that's going around about you know, you got to constantly shock the muscles, surprise them with new movements every day, um, that is not the, fish, the most efficient way to go about making progress, gains. All right, for the pull-ups, we did three sets, six to eight, moved on to OHP. Here we did four sets of three to five. And I believe Tankster hit some PRs here. He was able to hit, um, I believe, four sets of five with the 115, which he's never done at any weight that he's been at. See his happy ass face? <laughs> I love seeing that that reaction off him off him. It takes it takes a little bit to get him to react that way. And uh, I was glad I got I got it on camera. Alright, so with me I was able to complete three sets of one eighty five for five reps and then the fourth was a, a grinder well, it would have been a grinder for the fifth rep, so I stopped at four. I I could have I could have grinded it out and got the fifth and made that a PR, but I didn't want to. I don't want to rush moving on. I'm not in a rush to to increase the weight. I want my form. I want my I want my form on point before I move move the weight up. So I think I think I I, I got the my my fourth set on on video so I think this is my first there's five reps I think this is tankster's fourth also so we, we, yeah we filmed the first and last set in my opinion with from my experience I believe pressing movements like the bench press and the OHP. I think those are the uh, the mo- the last movement to be developed by you know a new bodybuilder, a new powerlifter, um, or a new bodybuilder. I wouldn't say powerlifter. I don't have too much experience in the powerlifting. Um, I started as a bodybuilder, but I think bench press and <clears throat> all the pressing movements was last to increase on my lifts. So I'm saying I believe it comes with with experience, training experience, and then weight. Of course, with when you're putting on weight, you're going to be able to push push more weight, right? Yep. There you go. And I laughed like, okay, I'll get it next time. I right, moved on to barbell curls. We decided to stay in this room. It was pretty busy. It was starting to get busy in the, the main room where all the machines were. So we stayed in here. Tankster grabbed a, I think that's a 70 or 80. We did three sets of 68 reps. I grabbed the big bar and just threw on, um, what is that, 115 pounds. I hit three sets of six. Short-term goal is I, I want to work up to um, the 45s on each side, 135, and get that for a clean, you know, six to eight reps. <clears throat> I've done it before. I mean, I, I probably the most I've done was like five, but that was like one set, and that 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 just smoked me. I wouldn't be able to get another set of probably four. All right, close grip bench. <clears throat> Same thing, three sets, six to eight reps. I, I 
put on some more weight. I bumped it up to 235 and was able to hit it for two sets of eight. And then last set, I hit seven reps. So next week, I'm going to make it um, a, a goal of hitting 235 for three sets of eight reps. And once I do that, if, if my form and my bar speed is at my standard, if I'm satisfied with the, uh, the speed and the, the form, I'll move it up to probably 240 or 245 depending on how I feel because again even if I bump it up to 245 and I'm able to hit three sets of six that is <clears throat> a win I'm still matching the rep range all right dumbbell shrugs for some reason these hundreds were um, get more difficult than usual because uh, usually I tell you guys that hundreds are too too light for me and 120s would be good I might have cut the rest time a little bit too short in between sets which is what I do so I can keep the intensity up for these hundreds because we don't have the 120s <clears throat> at golds so I hit three sets 10 first set I did 10 reps 8 reps and then 8 reps for the last That is it, guys. Wraps up another video. Um, again, I apologize for not posting as often as I usually do. But I will be back on the posting regularly for you guys. Peace, guys. You go, I go, you stay, I stay, one song to sing.